adoptability as a as a means, I think, is something which uh, I think India is ready for. You can see portability in very many, many, many um, uh, spheres of activity. For example, I think the telecom regulator is talking about portability of telephone numbers, for instance. So this whole idea of portability is something which we must give a fair try to. Yeah. Will it be only in life insurance or in non-life both? Largely, it will be an issue for health more than anything else, and to some extent for motor car. Because, you know, the, if you buy a health insurance, certain types of uh, conditions are not claimable for one year after the policy is in force. Some are not, not cut for two years, some are not for, for three years. And only thereafter is it uh, covers all the, all the conditions. So, but in ULIPS also performance is an issue where portability should be allowed. I'm sorry? In ULIPS also, portability should be allowed because performance of funds is <coughs> an issue. Yes and no. Yes and no, because there we'll have to balance the need to ensure there is not significant churn. Because once you have a churning portfolio, the person who's going to get uh, uh, negatively impacted will largely be the policy holder. <coughs> the universal life segment is very akin to a ULIP in certain ways, and certain flexibilities it has, uh, and certain product benefits it has, which is similar to a uh, um, term product. So that's a new new kind of product in the Indian insurance uh, market. And uh, we believe that uh, it poses certain <coughs> types of uh, challenges and poses certain types of risks which need to be addressed in the policyholders' uh, interests. And therefore, for universal life, we expect to, the, uh, the regulatory authority will be coming up with guidelines very soon. I only know the direction in which I would like to see the industry move. And that is to see that the insurance contracts are not as dense and not written in the kind of language which they are. And that they should be written in more accessible language, subject, of course, to legal clarity. And I think certain <coughs> types of products, you know, plain vanilla products, do not require the density of, uh, of, of, of legal construct which they currently do have. I think that's a hangover from the past.